Hello everybody and welcome back to Provis Gaming and more of Klaus's Wunderstrafanstalt! Okay, we are expanding several different buildings and rooms and services and stuff, trying to make people happy. Doing everything I can. We'll see if it actually works. First things first, we need to go ahead and get some fencing going in a few different places. What's this perimeter wall thing? $200 per square foot, ouch. We're not gonna worry about that right now. Let's just go ahead and get some basic fencing. I'm actually gonna go ahead and just sort of preemptively get this area set up. Because I know I want to get forestry going at some point as well. Um, we'll do something like this for now. That'll be okay. Yeah, we'll open this place up. Uh, I think I am going to make this in just a parole office. And uh, people will have to let me know if this security room really serves much of a purpose. It might be a bit of a red herring, you know? Something to distract you, but it doesn't actually serve much use? I don't know yet. Put in a jail door here. Put one in the mail room. Put one at the shop. Now, library. What do we need? Library shelf and a sorting desk. Well, what is that? Library shelf, sorting desk. Really? Okay, we'll put a desk here then. And the shelves are way bigger than I thought they would be. Oh my gosh. Okay. One, two, three. Doop, doop. And we'll just leave it like that. Cool. I mean, that's a little bit expensive, but if it makes my prisoners happy, then I guess that will uh, be fine. Let's see, for a shop, we need a table, shop's shelf, and it has to be adjacent to the room. There's another room, shop front? Wait a minute, what? I feel like I've been had here. Okay, maybe we're not going to do this. Hang on. I don't think I can have parole. Sorry, parole is, comes second. Parole is not as important as getting the mail and stuff. I don't know. Uh, instead, yeah, let's see. We need a shop front, shop front. Where is that? Is it in here somewhere? Roll. I'm confused. Shop. It just says shop. Adjacent to room, shop front. I don't see evidence that that exists in this game. Is there something else I need to learn about? I don't think so. I mean, there's a lot of stuff I could learn about. Guard towers? When did that get added into the game? Snipers? <laughs> a little bit scary, right? Still be kind of cool. Micromanagement. Unlocks food logistic. Well, I mean, we should do this no matter what, right? Let's go ahead and do that. Uh, I want to unlock dogs. Spend a bit of money working on that next. There is an object, I think. Shop front. Oh, 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 oh. I, s I think, I think, think, think that at this, what this actually means is that there has to be like a shop front in the, in the wall? How does this work? What is this black magic? Okay, we're, we're gonna at least put a shelf or two in a few places like so. Let's get rid of that door. Adjacent to room. What if we did, what if we did this? I don't know. It just has to be adjacent to the room. Somewhere they need to be able to like sell the goods. I get that in concept. But adjacent to room. I'm not sure if this will be enough. I'm not sure if our workers will be able to access the area. I have no idea. But I have a feeling that that might be how it works. All right, so if that's the case, parole might be back on. So huzzah for the poor people that are uh, desperately looking <laughs> to get out of here. We needed a sorting desk and a table. Okay, sorting desk will go here. Table will go here. And we'll say that that's good enough. Speed things up. Wally workers, get to it. Oh my gosh, look at all the deliver deliveries. Deliveries? Yes, very deliberative. Look how much stuff is in the way. Gosh. We desperately need a storage area, I think. Look at all this stuff arriving. We got nowhere to put it. Okay. This is no longer working for me. Um. Um. Let's, let's see if we can't get some foundations placed over here. Even if it's a small... This is just a sucky location. We... Oh. Ooh. Oops. I think we got rid of... We got rid of the sidewalk. Alright. Never mind. We'll do it anyway. Screw it. Let's just commit to it. Even if it's a tiny storage area, anything to give them more space to work with will be better than what we've got so far. At least one would certainly hope. Uh, we need to get some electricity down here, don't we? Yeah, I think we do. Okay. Do something like that. Cool. Is the fencing up yet? Do we actually... We did place the fencing, right? Or did we cancel it? No, they're still working on it. 
Oh, right, because they're working on the classroom right now. I get you now. They're just distracted. We need to get a staff door. And we'll see if we can't unlock this as a little storage area, just because we're overflowing and the doors can't close and it's driving me nuts. Stop leaving your food trays around like this. You guys are a bunch of slobs. My lord. What is wrong with you people? Why, you need a, you need another entrance? It's because I messed up the foundations and made this a foundation and this little thing down a foundation. Whatever. Yeah, they can place another door. It'll fix itself. We'll just dismantle it immediately afterwards. Yes, build. Okay, thank you. Let's dismantle this. Let's destroy this wall. And then we'll create a storage area. Where is it? It's here before. Storage. Yeah. This will be a storage area for you. And now this door can't close. Okay, I'm getting, I'm getting a little bit concerned here. Is it because of the garbage? Or is it because it's like conflicting with the road gate? Can someone please... Can, can someone please move the garbage? Ple please. Oh, good lord. Oh, he just put the garbage back down! Alright, that guy needs to be fired. Find his name. Send me a list. And I'll make sure that he's properly punished later. This library is going to be kind of cool, though, right? I have to imagine that my workers, all right, my prisoners are going to be very happy about that. Hmm. There's definitely a lot more content in the game than there used to be, but... I don't know. In a way, it almost feels a little bit overwhelming. Um, we have a lot more prisoner capacity. Let's see if we can go ahead and increase the intake again. Number of per day, 10. Sure, why not? Need to make more daily cash flow, or we will go broke. Hey, I'm still serving... Oh, I'm sorry. I get it now. The 93% is attached to this, not the overall grant. I get it now. It's okay. Not broken. Not stupid. Makes sense. Me stupid. Please take the trash out. For the love of God. It's like asking my wife to take the trash out. It's just never going to happen. B -b -b Thank you. Oh, gosh. <laughs> Blitz's mother is so eager to see her... Uh, daughter, I guess. This is a female prison. I had to think about that for a second. She's just banging her head repeatedly against the gate. Whack, 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 whack. Hey, look! Prisoners! Hi, how you doing? Line them on up. What do we got? AKA Mode Killer Nucci put in prison after becoming world famous for kidnapping YouTube star PewDiePie. Indie video game piracy. Uh, okay. How about indie video game ransoming or something? I don't know. Okay, well, somebody likes PewDiePie. Car thefts. Arson. Period. There's nothing special about Crow. Just, she's silent. She's a mute, apparently. Convicted on 47 counts of animal abuse when Amy was caught running a kitten boot camp in an attempt to create a feline assassin army for an undisclosed purpose. Sentenced to 67 years for multiple crimes, including arson, arson, and perjury. She, oh gosh, she's gonna die in this prison. Esmia Insane Cat Lady. Wow. Someone had fun with that one. Joyriding. Violent Disorder. False Imprisonment. False Imprisonment? What, you mean she shouldn't be here? Is that what you're trying to say? Hey, look. Another baby. Drunk Disorderly Behavior. And she's gonna have to spend a year in here with a toddler? For disorderly behavior because she was drunk? That seems a little harsh. Don't you think? I think so. Hey, um, please be very careful not to let prisoners run through here because right now this road gate is locked open because there's a prisoner in the way. I can see that posing a problem. Let's open the door. And then let's close the door. I actually think I should assign a guard here in visitation. Because if they start feeding off some sort of contraband, we're going to have a problem. I have a very serious problem, in fact. Okay. Okay. Got $19,000 to work with. My workers are spending forever working on this stuff. Lock open the door. There you go. Oh, they're just working on the fence as well. This is going to get complicated really quickly, isn't it? I said lock, lock shut? Lock open. There we go. That's what I wanted to see. Why is there a jail door here? What did I say I was going to do with the jail door here? I actually can't remember. Huh, well... Anyways, uh, how are the needs looking for my prisons? Prisoners. Food, of course, is still really bad. We did finish with the low quantity meals, so we should actually change that up now. Policy. High variety and quantity? Yeah, high variety. We need three meals. Good lord. Regime. 
So we're going to change things up a little bit. There we go. And they get a meal. And then they go to lock up. So a lot of time spent on lunch. A little bit of, mm, excuse me, breakfast. And then kind of a late dinner after the work day. That's what's going to happen. Uh, I kind of wonder if we need to increase the capacity for our kitchen. Because that's going to be a lot of extra food. Also, this place is disgusting. Would you guys mind, like, throwing your stuff away? It's very unsanitary. I'm not making the prisoners go through hygiene, and it doesn't seem like you guys have a clue what you're talking about. All right, well, let's put in a couple extra cookers. Ah. Uh, and we'll put an extra fridge in here somewhere. I think this is facing the right direction. Something like that. Probably is okay, right? Whoop, 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 whoop. Someone's getting into a fight with the officer. She's nude! How is she nude? Was that just a graphical glitch? Because now she's got a jumpsuit on. I think she, like, stripped off her clothes and then attacked the officer. Well, that's just downright terrifying there. These women are so uncivilized. I say it with a very high and mighty perspective. It's just like, Ugh. Of course. A bunch of prisoners. What are you expecting? Don't patronize them. That's how you upset them. Where are they going up here, by the way? I mean, I understand that they can get contraband around fences. There's some sort of invisible person that runs up and throws contraband over the fence. I get that, but... For real, though, I don't see that they have any incentive to just run around like that. Go get some food. Guys, seriously. I know you're hungry. You know you're hungry. It's eat time. Go eat. Also, don't start any fights, please, for the love of God. Oh, he's on a break. <laughs> Great. Can we get a replacement down here, please? This is how snitches get killed. We have proven this time and time again. Oh, boy. Storage needs electricity. Ah, I mean, if you say so. Somehow I don't see that as a very high priority, but we'll get the single solitary depressing light in there. Hey, I never actually turned on the shower, did I? Oops. Let's see. Shower. Let's just increase our showering capacity like so. Perfect. Hey, look. People are eating in the nursery. I didn't even have to micromanage them. It just worked. Huzzah! What does legal do for us? Unlocks the lawyer who can be hired from the staff toolbar, unlocks a number of research options to give you greater control over your prison. Such as small cells beyond the legal requirements. In other words, we can abuse our prisoners even more and get away, uh, away with it because we have a lawyer. Permanent punishments? Confine prisoners to a cell permanently. My god. Death row. Legal prep. Every prison runs into problems every now and then, and then and then some of them come back with the fairly legal consequences. Your lawyer will start the paperwork to keep the heat off. You should keep off you. Should something go horribly wrong, but this needs to be done in advance. Legal defense. You're in a bad situation. Something went terribly wrong, and you've been put on notice. If it looks like you aren't going to be able to manage the situation, your lawyer can help you get off the hook. Really? So basically, if you're losing the game horribly, then this could be an option for you. Is that what you're trying to say? I mean, I, I like to think that I'm not going to lose the game horribly. This place is disgusting. Okay, we need to hire another janitor. Because this is just nuts. Clean the place up, please. So gross. Maybe we should hire another cook. Everything's just gross. Good lord, people. I've hired a bunch of slobs. Do we need more guards? Because it seems like they're always busy right now. Granted, I know we have a few stashed in a few places... This person on patrol probably isn't doing a lot for us, but let's just get another guard. Maybe two, actually. Because there appears to be a lot of tasks to work on there. Alright, electricity's done. Good. Uh, did we not build the wall? Did I tell them not to build the walls here? No, I totally did. What are you guys doing? Oh, wait. They have nowhere to go because I just fenced this area off, didn't I? Well, I'm about to, anyway. Lock open the door. Get them out. Finish up that fencing, please. And then we can clear out more fencing and let you in more easily. I can't do that. I, w I was going to say let's just demolish this and kind of give them easy access so they can get to the prison quickly, but I'm just really scared. And if I do that, prisoners are just going to make a beeline for it, and I'm going to lose like 50 of them, and then we're going to have a serious problem. And that says something because I've got 50 prisoners. If I lose 50 of them, it means I lost them all. Seriously, this place is really gross. You guys are just dumping food all over the place. Do we need to get a bin in here? I don't recall needing a bin in the kitchen, but maybe we do. Tidiness is important when it comes to contraband. That's just for contraband, though. You are teaching them terribly. Look at this. They're not cooking food. They're just throwing cabbage on the floor. That's disgusting. People, why? All right, utilities, electrical cables. Actually, these are already hooked up. We're good. We're good. 
Still got $16,000 in the bank. That's not too bad. Uh, still serving our meals. That's good. We need prisoners to work in the kitchen, but they haven't been educated yet. Let's take a look at the programs. It's actually getting really close to being done. Two have finished. One has passed. Oh, I see. So two people finished it. Only half. Only one person actually successfully finished the course. We need to do one, uh, two more people. I need to get some more capacitors because I'm looking at this electricity thinking, holy crap, we are really close to having some serious problems. So yeah, let's please fix that. Thank you kindly. Oop. Someone got caught. What'd you do? No, no contraband. All right. Well, I am sorry for doubting you. You are obviously a respectable and morally upstanding person. Okay, is the fence done? Gosh dang it, it's not quite done. It's really close to being done. Demolish the walls. By the time they get to it, we'll be fine. There we go. We just need to give them a way out, and now they can move around a lot faster. What's this? Shop goods. Why did you leave this behind? Go pick it up. What are you guys doing? Oh, good grief. They didn't fix their pathing. They took the stupid route. Oh, what are you guys doing? What are you guys doing? You're killing me, Smalls. All right, well, the library's done. Do we need to hire, like, a librarian or something? Madam Librarian? Dog handler. No. No. Do we need to assign people to work in the library? That could be. Logistics. Oh, yeah, totally. We need a foundation education program. I need to actually educate people first. Okay. Uh, how about two people in the mail room? Two people operating the shop. Uh, is the shop actually, like, working now? It doesn't have a table. Did I not ins install a table? Apparently I did not. Okay. Fix that. And you know what? Let's just get a door. I, I kind of suspect they need to be able to get in. And this is going to be just, like, th the desk where they sell things across. You know, to the prisoners who come looking for stuff. I'm just guessing. Okay? Never built that before. But I'm guessing that's what we need. All right. How are we looking? Storage is full. <laughs> That's fun. But at least the doors are closing, so now people can actually uh, go use the turret. Which is just disgusting. It's like a, a stone throw from their food. Gross. Very unhygienic. Let's build um, some foundation, I think. I'm going to start prepping up for this area here. We'll do this for now. I'll need to expand out the yard and stuff, too. I don't know. I think we need a bigger yard, ultimately. I think it's just going to be too small for these prisoners. Uh, and let's just go ahead and demolish some walls here. There. Does that count as an entrance? Are you okay with that? No? You need an entrance. You absolutely have to have an entrance? Is that what you're trying to tell me? Or have we not finished putting it together? Oh, never mind. We hadn't finished putting it together. No? Okay, when is it going to be done? Seriously. There we go. Thank you. Workers just couldn't make up their minds. I need some sort of indicator. Hey. Hey. There's one single tile that hasn't been built. We can't finish the building. You know what I mean? I think you know what I mean. Alright. Well, we have a really large prison going on right now. This is not so bad. Not so bad at all. And we have a couple of guards off duty with nothing to do, which means that we're actually doing fine on personnel. Not overstocked at all. Could probably use an extra laundry machine. I'm going to go ahead and build one there. I uh, don't even know if we need any more ironing tables. And can we start an education program now? I think we probably can. Foundation education program, 17 people interested. Good, good. Hey, forest people have passed their kitchen safety and hygiene. Good, I can actually assign people to work in the kitchen now. We don't need to hire any more chefs. The prisoners shall cook it all. Laundry distribution. Whoa, what is this? What does this do? What does it mean? Food distribution. I mean, this is really helpful as far as seeing some stuff, but, like, what does this mean? I mean, th th why are these stopping here? Holding cell, reception. Does the laundry not access this area? I don't understand what you're trying to get at there. Hmm. Okay. Well, finish another grant. 10000 extra dollars for us. Let's go to the grants page. The reform through education, prison manufacturing. Ah, we need to build 30 license plates. I could do that. How about tool cleanup? Remove supply of stolen tools. Following a number of incidents in other prisons involving stolen items. Not this one, okay? We did not have two people die from a drill to the side of the head. Those are vicious rumors, slander, libel, and Klaus will sue you all. Following a number of incidents in other prisons involving stolen items. A group is performing studies on the distribution of tools and weapons throughout prisons. This part of the trial involves trying to remove all such items from your prison population. Let's pick it up. 
Reason being, if there are none, then it'll immediately go away. And if there are some, I should do a shakedown. Uh-oh. It appears that there are probably stolen weapons and tools. That's it. I don't care if it's 2 a.m. Shakedown time! Go get them. Get them, boys. Let's find out where all the weapons are. Well, I found a screwdriver. Okay, that's one of those tools I was talking about. And a knife. Well, I mean, there should be knives in the kitchen. Was it stored in an unexpected place and you assumed the prisoners were involved? Found some drugs, found some alcohol. We probably should have gotten the grant that allows us to um, find the illegal narcotics or something. Maybe we could have finished that. Well, either way, this is going to upset a lot of people, but I don't mind. Seems perfectly fine to me. Why do we have 42 prisoners now? We used to have 41. We didn't get just one prisoner, surely. Unless the baby grew up and became a prisoner. Is that how that works? It's not supposed to be, but... I mean, that'd be kind of funny if it were. Well, still finding stuff. Hmm. Where's the... Where's the thing? Where'd, where'd the grant go? Does the... I, I'm, I'm confused. Does the grant, like, just go away until you finish your shakedown? I don't know, but there's a few more places that need to be searched. All down here in the shop. Yeah, that seems like a convenient location to be stealing stuff and putting them. There we go. Okay, we're... The, oh, wait, we finished it. Oh, I just didn't even see the pop-up. Well, that's why I got confused. Crack down on drugs. Yeah, find ten illegal narcotics. And that's one more thing we could have picked up. But it's fine, it's fine. Let's do... You know what? Let's pick up the prison manufacturing facility. Now we got $60,000 to work with. And I already know that I want to build a workshop. So let's go ahead and start building one next. And we'll finish that off next time. Thank you all for watching. I do hope that you enjoyed. If so, then be sure to hit that like button, leave a comment, and subscribe. Tell me what I'm doing wrong. And I, as always, will see you guys next time.